cold, rainy day. I always wait till I get to Michigan to get gas and to eat so all my money goes into the Michigan economy and not Indiana. <laughs> Your trip begins at Michigan.org. Weather is not ideal. How are we doing, Bouquet? We okay? I'm transporting live goods. <laughs> How far would you like to be? It's like 6.45 a.m. right now. I left super early. Yesterday I went to the florist. We'll sell flowers. Probably one of the best neons in Chicago. All right, flowers acquired. And now I'm on my way to mid-Michigan to surprise my mom for her birthday. She has no idea I'm coming, so I'm very excited, hoping to get a nice reaction face out of her. But I'm actually gonna be way earlier than I need to be there, so we have some time. So I'm gonna eat breakfast. Uh, not a lot of options for... <laughs> if I had all the time in the world, I would go mess up that Bob Evans right now. I would eat a lot there. I wouldn't like go into their bathroom and... So Bob Evans, we do it right or we don't do it. Looking at the donations, we got one that's perfect because this is kind of a choose your own adventure. Perfect for today as I have no idea what I'm gonna eat at this very moment, but I'm starving and there's like the same seven fast food restaurants at every stop. So let's give it up for today's donor, Mr. Dan Rogers. This is written so beautifully. Talk about how great I am. <laughs> oh, I can do that, Dan Rogers. Dan supports everything I do on the internet. He watches all the shows, all the vlogs, around the circuit of everything that's going on on this internet that includes me. I think right off the bat, we gotta talk about this Venmo avatar, AKA your face. You're in a tuxedo, you've got beautiful facial hair, your hair is kinda swooped over, looks like you might have used some Crest white strips in the last six months. You're looking like a rock solid 10, my dude. Come in here, looking like a rock solid wow. 10. <laughs> Let's not get too crazy. This is a food video, not pornography. I'm in Benton Harbor, Michigan, which is like very, very close to Lake Michigan. I'm kinda zipping along the, the lakeside front, not how people say it. And near me right now, as I pulled off for gas, a Subway, an IHOP, a McDonald's, a Bob Evans, a Sophia's House of Pancakes. I can't imagine they have a drive through Ooh, a Wendy's. Yeah, that Wendy's and then a Burger King. I never eat Wendy's or Burger King breakfast like ever, ever, ever. I can count on one hand how many times I've had each of those for breakfast. Can I flip a coin? Fate is in the hands of the old president. You tubble on looking motherfucker. Do I even have a coin? What? Sadly, my change drawer doesn't have anything higher than a dime. So let's keep the theme going. I'm gonna flip a, I'm gonna flip an Abraham Lincoln. Can you shut the fuck up? That's it. Heads is Burger King, tails is Wendy's. And then I'm gonna order off the menu whatever strikes my fancy. I have no idea what they even feature. Flip, catch, smack, tails, Wendy's. Woo! Only Wendy's serves a better breakfast with a better biscuit. A hot buttery treasure loaded. Get a free honey butter chicken biscuit at Wendy's. I was excited either way. It's at a gas station. I put this the what can I get for you Could I do a honey butter chicken biscuit meal? You want orange juice with that? No, could I actually switch it to a cold brew? Coffee? Yes, you may. And that'll be perfect. That was a super weird experience. There were like two guys changing the sign over, but I don't think they worked at Wendy's. They were just like standing in front of the sign as I was ordering. One guy's pants were all the way down to his ankles. Jesus Christ. Sometimes the experiences in the drive-thru are just so weird. It's like so American and human and just hilarious. Thank you. Do you, I have the receipt too. Thank you so much. How is this $11? When she said $10.90, I thought... What can I get fresh for you then? Hi, I just came through the drive-thru and um, got the um, honey butter chicken biscuit meal. Yeah. But I was charged $10.90. I know. Come to the window. Okay, can I actually um, throw in another sandwich too? Which one? Could I do the uh, hot honey chicken biscuit? Okay. See what I mean? You gotta stay on top of these people. It was supposed to be $4.99. But you know what guys? The writing's on the wall. Wendy's never cuts corners. I go, you charged me $10.90. She goes, I know. <laughs> Doesn't even say sorry. But I was charged $10.90. I know. I know. <laughs> That's the one that, um... We had get your refund on your card. Okay, that's all right, thank you. All right, I think we're all squared away. We'll see on my credit card dashboard in about one hour. <laughs> it has been a long time since I've had Wendy's breakfast. I think I've only had it 
maybe two, three other times. But these potato wedges that they do, look at the seasoning. These things are absolutely legendary. So many different breakfast places like do just the, you know, the patty or the little circle bites, whatever. I love the wedges. I think this is amazing. And this is a big serving. They last so much longer than like the McDonald's hash brown, which I always put on my sandwich, but it takes like two bites to eat it. Those are fantastic. This is what a large Coke would come in. And this is coffee. First up is the honey butter. Dang, that looks good. I'm showing you two sandwiches again today. One's just a traditional honey butter biscuit, and the other one is the spicy. They look very similar. These things are probably insulting to people in the South who have just unbelievable access to the most insane chicken biscuits for the morning, but you know what? We don't have a lot of that in the Midwest. Looks pretty damn good. The hot one, very similar. Little darker tinge to the chicken, but looking equally delish. Is this one of your guys' favorite fast food breakfast sandwiches? Let's chat fast food breakfast sandwiches in the comments today as I drive to my mom's because it's a dialogue that I have a lot of knowledge on. <laughs> These potatoes also sit on this beautiful looking chicken filet ever so easily. Like four of these bad boys on here. That's how we roll. Right there. All right, Dan Rogers, you beautiful, gracious bastard. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for the donation. Road trips, pilot gas stations, food. So good. Wendy's does chicken well. Wendy's does biscuits well. Wendy's does potatoes well. All white meat chicken, big old filet. Can't go wrong. Does Wendy's have hot sauce packets? They put a lot of honey on that though, so it's not that dry, like vacuum cleaner bag taste. <laughs> All right, I'm excited for this spicy one. What a morning. Oh yeah, Shawnee two sandwiches. Wendy's kind of dominates the breakfast game right now. Big ass cold brew coffee, that's good. Solid biscuits, chicken filet way better than McDonald's chicken. Does Culver's have breakfast? Is that really good? I know a lot of people are obsessed with Chick-fil-A. It's just not as readily available in Michigan or the Midwest as it is where probably you live. Mmm! If you don't put the breakfast potato, no matter what it is, on the breakfast sandwich, you're not quite living up to the potential your parents saw for you. And that's a problem. It's a very easy fix. <laughs> At McDonald's, I have to get two hash browns because I like the side bite of it, but I like it on the sandwich. The good thing with Wendy's, you can put them on two sandwiches and still have like 58 of these left. Like that just looks good. Crispy, hot, good. <laughs> Crispy, hot, good. You're a moron. Taco Bell's got good breakfast too, but that's such a uh, investment. You need to know that if you're eating that in the car, you're inevitably going to be at a rest stop for a few minutes. And you need to like bake that into your travel time. <laughs> this hot chicken biscuit is fire. Mm-hmm. This one's just more tender for some reason. Damn, what do you say? Am I YouTubing it? As far as like road trip for me, like to and from Chicago, Wendy's is like probably top of the list. Now for like breakfast and lunch and dinner, I just feel better eating Wendy's over McDonald's and Burger King and stuff like that. The hot honey isn't hot enough. I want it like a little more hit. Like I want it as hot as like the hot and spicy chicken patty from McDonald's. So I do wish it had like that level of heat. But overall, great. That's tender. Good breading, good crisp. Wow, I'm not gonna lie. I was pretty skeptical when one, it was connected to a gas station, and two, they mischarged me. <laughs> but they rebounded really nicely. My road trip breakfast of choice, Wendy's. My road trip gas station of choice would be a Speedway. We're on your way to convenience stores of Speedway. Last bite. All right, let's get on the road, go surprise my mom, and have a nice little day. Benton Harbor needs my crumbs. I like to fully get out of the car and like just, probably looks, looks a little sus if somebody's in this motel and they just see me going. Damn, that was good. And she gave me 77 napkins in this bag. Going in the safe. Wendy's, you stumbled to start and you just saying bolded it to the end, dude. Uh, was... The best cold brew in the game. Man, Wendy's is really just like, 
Wendy's is kind of on an island right now. Who top to bottom does everything that they do? Chick-fil-A has to be the only competitor, but the Sunday thing kills them. I want that on Sunday. I don't need it on a Tuesday afternoon, Chick-fil-A. Change the Sabbath. <laughs> She's surprised. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> That's your reaction. <laughs> Happy birthday. Holy moly. Oh, Happy birthday. Thank you. It's my son. How are you? I thought he was being a dick. I know, just like a weird flower messenger guy. Just like this. <laughs> how are you? How you Good to see you. Where she dropped an F bomb. She dropped. Here, I mean, how did you? I took the last train in. <laughs> you took the A train. Take the A train if you want to get to Harlem in a hurry. Oh my gosh, these are beautiful. They look nice. How are you? Happy over birthday. leather or leather jacket. You look cool. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. No, you don't say happy birthday back. Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs>